Welcome to the Bible Quiz. Today, we invite you on an enlightening journey through the lives of remarkable figures from the Old Testament. We've handpicked 25 engaging questions to test your knowledge of these influential figures and their stories. But before we get started, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button and show your support by liking this video. Your encouragement enables us to further spread the timeless wisdom of the Bible. And remember, after you complete the test, share your results with us in the comments section below. We are delighted to explore with you the fascinating characters of the Old Testament. Are you ready to embark on a fascinating journey through biblical history? Let's get started. Question 1. Which Old Testament prophet saw a vision of a valley of dry bones coming back to life? A. Ezekiel B. Isaiah C. Daniel D. Jeremiah. You get 10 seconds. That's A. Ezekiel. In Ezekiel chapter 37 verses 1 to 14, Visionary prophet Ezekiel testifies of a miraculous vision of a valley filled with dry bones. Through God's intervention, these lifeless skeletons were transformed into living humans demonstrating His power to revive and restore hope to the lonely people of Israel. Question 2. Who is the Israeli judge famous for his strength? A. Gideon B. Samson, C. Deborah, D. Jephthah. You get 10 seconds. That's B. Samson. The Israelite judge famous for his strength was Samson, as described in Judges chapter 13 to 16. Samson's extraordinary physical strength, along with his faith in God, enabled him to defeat Israel's enemies, the Philistines, in various encounters. His story illustrates the power of God working through individuals to achieve his purposes, despite human weakness and disadvantage. Question 3. Which Old Testament character survived being thrown into a fiery furnace? A. Shadrach B. Meshach C. Abedego D. All three people above You get 10 seconds. That's D, all three people above. In Daniel, chapter 3, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, three Jewish prisoners in Babylon, refused to bow to King Nebuchadnezzar's golden image. As punishment, they were thrown into a fiery furnace, but they miraculously survived unharmed thanks to God's intervention. This event represents God's protection of those who remain faithful to Him. Question 4. Which Old Testament character was sold into slavery by his brothers? A. Esau B. Jacob C. Joseph D. Isaac You get 10 seconds. That's C. Joseph. Joseph, son of Jacob, was sold into slavery by his jealous brothers, as recounted in Genesis chapter 37. Although he faced betrayal and adversity, Joseph remained loyal to God and eventually became famous in Egypt, demonstrating God's faithfulness and sovereignty in difficult circumstances. 
Question 5. Who led the Israelites across the Jordan River into the Promised Land? A. Aaron B. Joshua C. Caleb D. Moses You get 10 seconds. That's B, Joshua. Joshua, Moses' successor, led the Israelites across the Jordan River into the Promised Land, as described in the book of Joshua. With God's guidance and miraculous intervention, Joshua and the Israelites conquered the land of Canaan, fulfilling God's promise to Abraham and established the nation of Israel as their inheritance. Ensure you stay connected with us by subscribing you won't want to miss the awesome quizzes and content we have in store for you. Question 6. Which king was known for his wisdom and wealth? A. Solomon B. Saul C. David D. Rehoboam You get 10 seconds. That's A, Solomon, David's son Solomon, famous for his extraordinary wisdom and enormous wealth is vividly described in 1 Kings chapter 10, verses 23 to 24. His unparalleled brilliance attracted widespread admiration, while his reign epitomized an era of unparalleled prosperity and tranquility, signifying divine favor for the his leader. Question seven. What city did King Solomon of Israel rule? A. Babylon B. Jericho C. Damascus D. Jerusalem You get 10 seconds. That's D, Jerusalem. King Solomon, ruling from Jerusalem, established his dynasty over Israel and built the great temple of the Lord, recorded in 1 Kings chapter 8. Through this epic feat, Jerusalem emerged as a symbol for the unity and prosperity of the kingdom of Israel under the wise rule of Solomon, hailed the height of Israel's power and influence during his reign. Question 8. Which Old Testament prophet contradicted King Ahab and challenged the prophets of Baal on Mount Carmel? A. Isaiah B. Elisha C. Elijah D. Jeremiah You get 10 seconds. That's C, Elijah. The prophet Elijah's confrontation with King Ahab and the prophets of Baal on Mount Carmel, detailed in 1 Kings chapter 18, shows boldness and strong faith. Through this encounter, Elijah demonstrated God's power and sovereignty over the false gods of Baal, affirming God's sovereignty and revealing his glory to the people. Question 9. What was the name of the prophet who witnessed the vision of a flying scroll and a woman in a basket? A. Malachi B. Zechariah C. Hosea D. Zechariah You get 10 seconds. That's B, Zechariah. 
Zechariah's vision in Zechariah chapter 5 verses 1 to 11 features a flying scroll and a woman in a basket, symbolizing divine judgment and restoration. The scroll depicted judgment on sinners, while the woman symbolized the removal of wickedness. This vision conveyed God's message of accountability for sin and the eventual restoration of righteousness. Question 10. Who was the Old Testament prophet famous for his patience and endurance of extreme suffering? A. Nahum B. Jonah C. Amos D. Job You get 10 seconds. That's D, Job. Job, famous for his extraordinary patience and unwavering endurance through great suffering and loss, maintained his faith and steadfast trust in God's sovereignty. His story, described in the book of Job, is a profound testament. His steadfastness in the face of adversity continues to inspire and uplift believers across generations. Question 11. Who is the character known for his ability to interpret dreams while imprisoned in Egypt? A. Joseph B. Ezra C. Daniel D. Jeremiah You get 10 seconds. That's A, Joseph, in Genesis chapter 41, verses 1 to 36. Through divine intervention, Joseph accurately decoded the Pharaoh's dreams, which eventually catapulted him from prison to a position of power in Egypt. This remarkable event emphasizes God's sovereignty in arranging circumstances to accomplish his divine purposes. Question 12. Who was the prophet who faced King Ahab and prophesied a severe drought in Israel? A. Isaiah B. Elisha C. Elijah D. Jeremiah You get 10 seconds. That's C, Elijah. Elijah boldly confronted King Ahab and prophesied a severe drought in Israel, as recorded in 1 Kings chapter 17, verse 1. His courageous stand against idolatry and his steadfast commitment to preaching God's truth challenged the nation's morale, emphasizing the importance of loyalty and commitment. Obey God's commands. Question 13. Which character is known for his bravery in fighting a giant Philistine warrior named Goliath? A. Saul B. David C. Absalom D. Jonathan You get 10 seconds. That's B, David. David, a shepherd boy, showed exceptional courage when he faced and defeated the giant Philistine warrior Goliath. This symbolic event, recounted in the Old Testament book of 1 Samuel chapter 17, highlights David's steadfast faith in God and courage in the face of adversity. Question 14. What was the name of the prophet who was carried to heaven in a whirlwind and succeeded by Elisha? A. Jeremiah B. Elisha C. Isaiah D. Elijah You get 10 seconds.
That's D, Elijah. In 2 Kings chapter 2, verses 1 to 18, the prophet Elijah experienced a dramatic departure from this world when he was taken up into heaven in a whirlwind. This special event marks the end of Elijah's ministry and the beginning of Elisha's prophetic journey, signified God's divine endorsement of Elisha as his successor and emphasized the continuity of prophetic leadership in Israel. It also stands as a testament to Elijah's faithful service and the profound impact his ministry had on the nation of Israel. Question 15. What was the name of the king who succeeded Saul and became David's close friend? A. Jonathan B. Joab C. Abner D. Jonathan You get 10 seconds. That's A, Jonathan. King Saul's son Jonathan became a close friend and ally of David, as described in the Old Testament book of 1 Samuel. Their deep bond and mutual respect are highlighted throughout their interactions, illustrating the power of friendship even in challenging circumstances. Question 16. Who was the Old Testament prophet who prophesied the coming of the Messiah and the sufferings he would endure? A. Daniel B. Ezekiel C. Isaiah D. Jeremiah You get 10 seconds. That's C, Isaiah. The prophet Isaiah, in the Old Testament book that bears his name, specifically Isaiah chapter 53, foretold the coming of the Messiah and described the sufferings that he would endure on behalf of humanity. Isaiah's prophecies provide insight into the redeeming work of the Messiah, bringing hope and comfort to believers throughout the ages. Question 17. Who is the king famous for repenting after committing adultery with Bathsheba? A. Saul B. David C. Solomon D. Hezekiah You get 10 seconds. That's B, David. King David, famous for his justice and leadership, fell into adultery when he had an affair with Bathsheba, the wife of Uriah the Hittite. David deeply repented when he met the prophet Nathan, as detailed in 2 Samuel chapter 12. This event emphasizes the importance of the sincere repentance and mercy of God, who forgave David's sins but also enforced discipline. Question 18. Which king famously killed a lion with his bare hands and then found honey in its carcass? A. Saul B. David C. Solomon D. Samson You get 10 seconds. That's D, Samson. Samson, a judge of Israel, demonstrated extraordinary strength by killing a lion with his bare hands, as recounted in Judges chapter 14, verses 5 to 6. His discovery of honey in the lion's carcass not only represents his physical strength, but also symbolizes the sweetness of victory and God's provision in the midst of trial. Question 19. Who was the prophet famous for his poems and laments about the destruction of Jerusalem? A. 
Jeremiah B. Daniel C. Isaiah D. Ezekiel You get 10 seconds. That's A, Jeremiah. Jeremiah, often called the weeping prophet, is famous for his poetic and heartfelt laments about the destruction of Jerusalem and the exile of the Israelites. His prophecies, recorded in the Old Testament book of Jeremiah, offer profound insights into God's judgment and mercy. Question 20. Who was the first king of Israel? A, Samuel. B. David C. Saul D. Solomon You get 10 seconds. That's C. Saul. In 1 Samuel chapter 10, verse 1, Saul was anointed by the prophet Samuel as the first king of Israel. Despite being chosen by God for this important role, Saul's reign was marred by disobedience and rebellion against God's commands. The story serves as a cautionary tale about the dangers of disobedience and the importance of remaining faithful to God's will. Question 21. What was the name of the woman who saved the Israeli baby Moses by placing him in a basket in the Nile River? A. Ruth B. Jochebed C. Miriam D. Deborah You get 10 seconds. That's B, Jochebed. Jochebed, Moses' mother, saved her son by placing him in a bamboo basket on the Nile to protect him from Pharaoh's edict to kill Jewish boys. This story is found in Exodus chapter 2, verses 1 to 10, where it describes how Jochebed determined to find a way to protect his son from Pharaoh's brutality and asked God for intervention and protection. Question 22. What did God provide for the Israelites to eat as they wandered in the wilderness? A. Fish B. Bread C. Quail D. Manna You get 10 seconds. That's D, manna. In Exodus chapter 16, verses 4 to 36, God describes providing manna, a type of bread, for the Israelites to eat during their wanderings in the desert. This miraculous provision is a symbol of God's care and provision for His people, showing His judgment and mercy towards those on the journey. Question 23. What was the name of the Old Testament character who interpreted Pharaoh's dream of seven fat and seven lean cows? A. Joseph B. Samuel C. Daniel D. Damascus You get 10 seconds. That's A, Joseph. Joseph, son of Jacob, interpreted Pharaoh's dream of seven fat and seven lean cows as a prophecy of seven years of prosperity, followed by seven years of drought. This event is recounted in Genesis chapter 41, verses 1 to 36, where Joseph, under God's guidance, helps explain and predict what will happen in the future through Pharaoh's dream. Question 24. 
which prophets summoned fire from heaven to burn watery offerings? A. Isaiah B. Elisha C. Elijah D. Jeremiah You get 10 seconds. That's C, Elijah. The prophet Elijah, with steadfast faith in God, asked him to send fire from heaven to consume his water-soaked offering as a demonstration of divine power. The special demonstration of God's sovereignty took place on Mount Carmel, as detailed in 1 Kings chapter 18, verses 20 to 40. Through this miraculous event, Elijah affirmed the sovereignty of the one true God over all creation, Question 25. Which woman bravely approached the king who became queen and saved her people from destruction? A. Ruth B. Hannah C. Deborah D. Esther You get 10 seconds. That's D, Esther. Esther, showing great courage and loyalty to her people, risked her life to approach King Xerxes, Ahasuerus, to intervene on behalf of the Jewish community facing destruction. Through her courage and strategic wisdom, Esther played a pivotal role in thwarting Haman's evil plots and ensuring the rescue of her people from impending destruction. Oh, wow. What an extraordinary expedition through the scriptures, delving into the stories of Old Testament characters. How did you experience this enlightening journey? Whether you have mastered it or not, puzzle or discover new insights, always remember that the stories of these biblical characters hold timeless wisdom and inspiration for us all. If you find this quiz fascinating, don't forget to show your support by liking the video and sharing it with your loved ones. Invite them to join us on this fascinating exploration of iconic figures of the Old Testament. And be sure to hit the subscribe button for more trivia and scripture insights. Your feedback is invaluable, so please share your scores, questions, or suggestions for future quizzes in the comments section below. Thank you for joining us on our adventure today. And may the stories of these biblical characters continue to inspire and guide you.